I'm Camille from Camille's Prime Ideas, and today I have a singing time lesson plan for teaching the primary song, Families Can Be Together Forever. Now, I know this is a fairly well-known primary song, but that said, not every primary child may know it, and it's still always great to sing these classics and make sure that they are learned and understood and the meaning is taught in singing time. So, to teach this activity, what I recommend is you create these family band pencils. Now I have printables here that contain pictures of a mom and a dad and a son and a daughter. And then I cut them out and laminated. I, print, I printed mine on cardstock. I cut out and laminated and then I punched a hole and then slid them onto a pencil. Now if you don't have time to do this, printable pencils work great as well. But this is just kind of fun. It just adds a little more variety, just spruces up our boring everyday regular pencil. If you know me, you know I'm a collector of pencils. My kids bring them home in droves. So I just repurpose them for all my singing time activities. It's great. All right, so you'll want to make sure every child has a family band pencil, no matter how you end up creating them. You can just call them a pencil if you need. Okay, and then I do recommend you post the words, especially for the second verse, because usually the second verse of this song is not as well known as the first verse. And then what you'll be doing is you'll just be pitch leading. Now, if you aren't familiar with what pitch leading is, you are leading the pitch. It's exactly as what it says it is. So as the notes go up, your hand is going up, you're leading up, and as the notes go down, you are leading them down. And my mom was upside down, now she's the right way. <laughs> All right, so we're just going to sing the song Pitch Leading. And afterwards, you can the kids can all trade pencils so they can, you know, one can hold the mom and then the next time they can hold maybe the boy. Anyway, and so on. So they can kind of trade pencils around. You can, at the end, let them have these, but I'll be honest, these were kind of a pain to cut out and I've been wanting, I want to keep them. So, but it's up to you if you want to just make them you make them maybe even a little less durable so they're not laminated so they can just take them home whatever you like i did keep mine all right so that's part of the activity so maybe the first time you just have everyone pitch lead the second part of the activity is what i've got here on the board and it's stick figure families so as you are pitch leading your song you can choose primary children depending on how many you may have you can have one or a few come up on the board and draw their stick figure family as the rest of the primary is pitch leading. So this is all really simple, but I love that what we're just drawing the eye towards families. So we've got our stick figure family, stick figure families on the board and our stick figure pencils. So as you are singing, you can have a few children on the board, just provide some coloring utensils, either that's dry erase markers, I drop everything. Dry erase markers or chalk or whatever you have on the board. You can go do multiple colors or just stick with basic plain color. And then I just, I you may want to demonstrate your family first when you draw your family. So I just demonstrated this is my husband and I and our gaggle of children. And we do have some chickens, but I did not include those. So if they want to add pets, they can too. So then you'll just, when the song's over, then those children that were drawing, they can go back and choose someone else to come up and draw, or you can, or teachers, or whatever. So you just want to sing the song enough that every child gets an opportunity to draw their family on the board. Really easy prep, really doesn't take much work. And then in the meantime, you, those children who are not drawing still have something to do as they are watching the other children draw on the board. So lots of singing, lots of moving, lots of doing. Just love it, it's all like a family. <laughs> so when you're finished, I recommend you bear testimony that because of the blessings of the temple, families can be together for eternity. And I do like to reinforce that we all have the opportunity to create an eternal family of our own by being worthy to be married in the temple. I know some primary music leaders kind of have a hard time with the song because it's talking about an ideal family situation. And some children might not be living in that, but I think if we reinforce the concept that every child has the opportunity to create their ideal family as they grow up, it really puts this song into 
the correct context and that every child has the same opportunity to have an eternal family. So I hope that helps you with singing time this week. I would love to hear how it goes in the comments.